Should humans be able to bring animals back from extinction? This week, there was a story from a company called Colossal Biosciences that's been working on bringing back the Tasmanian tiger, de-extincting the Tasmanian tiger, as they call it. And the company's been dedicated to doing this on a couple of different fronts. Uh, they promised that they'll bring the woolly mammoth back in five years. And the whole story raised some pretty obvious ethical concerns. I mean, Jurassic Parkian concerns, if you will, about whether we should do this and whether the control that we might need in order to do it is an illusion, as Ian Malcolm said in the movie. Uh, but the logic for doing it is also pretty compelling. Uh, the extinctions of many of these animals have happened because of humans, not because of natural occurrences. And so why shouldn't we correct it? It's a really interesting space of science, and the story behind it is going to raise some big questions that I imagine are going to happen for years and years to come. I'm Rohit Bhargava, curator of the Non-Obvious Insights newsletter, and that was my pick for the Non-Obvious Story of the Week. <laughs>